I welcome you to another series of our videos. So, we will continue talking about vectors. So, this problem is coming from uh, College Physics, COA, 11th edition. And this is uh, problem 63, under vectors. So, let's see what the question wants us to do. So, the question reads, the magnitude of a vector A is 35.0 units and points in the direction 325 degrees counterclockwise from the positive x-axis. Right, so from the positive x-axis. Then... The question, the question further says, calculate the x and y components of this vector. So, this question requires us to calculate the x and y components of the vector. So, it is important for us to understand the terms or the term counterclockwise. So, counterclockwise, we know what it means clockwise, meaning it's moving in this direction like the way a clock moves so counterclockwise sorry um counter uh, clockwise it's like this the direction of the clock then counterclockwise it's the opposite the the direction of the so in short we can say counterclockwise is just the same as anti-clockwise so let's see how we can tackle this question. So it is important that we draw a diagram representing this scenario here. So let's see how the diagram looks like. So this is the diagram. This is the x-axis. Then this is the angle. So which is this angle is 3 point, uh, 325 degrees counterclockwise meaning in this direction like that then the 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 magnitude it's 30 35 units like this information is in the question so they want us to find the y component and the x component so let's continue so to find the x component you use the formula x is equal to a cos theta. What is a? a is the magnitude of the vector, which is 35 units. And theta is the angle of the vector, which is 325 degrees. So when you punch that on a calculator, you get 28.6703215. So this can be written in three significant figures to be 28.7 units. Then let's also look at the y component. How do we find the y component? So the y component is given by the formula y is equal to a sine theta. So what is our a? Our a is the magnitude, which is 35. Then the theta is the angle, which is 325. So... When you punch this on a calculator, you find that the y component is negative 20.075171527 units. So this can be written in three significant figures to be negative 20.1 units. So we've answered what the question required us to do. So the x component of the vector is... 28.7 units and the y component of the vector is negative 20.1 units so we are done thank you for watching remember to subscribe